Hi friends, I am heading over to Dollar General. I want to take a look at what they have. I've never taken you guys shopping there. I think I've only ever been there one other time. So this will be my first time shopping at Dollar General. Let's go shopping. <laughs> So who knew Dollar General is loaded full of adorable home decor. I'm finding a lot of new things I'm going to share with you guys. Lots of modern farmhouse and boho like this basket for just $8. So my question to you is, is Dollar General better than Target Dollar Spot now? Because from what I'm seeing, I am convinced they've got so much to see. So we're going to start over here. We're going to look at everything, baskets, blankets, pillows, wall decor, there's just so much. So these are really surprisingly inexpensive, $6 for the small one. They tend to do things in graduated sizes and prices. So the larger ones are eight. They do have some placemats. I really like the aesthetic of this candle. They have lots of tabletop decor. Now I did find a lot of items that look like they would cost so much more anywhere else. Like these planters, they're $6. Are you kidding me? I think the larger one was actually eight. They also have these in gold for eight. And where was this during fall? It's a great dupe for some higher end decor for just $5. Also, I'm loving these votive holders in cement. Now they have some adorable throws. The most expensive was this one for $12. They have a bunch perfect for spring and summer that are lightweight for just $10 in some really cute prints. I love the stripes. They're also doing a lot of pillows, like this one I think is very modern boho. They also have a bunch up on top. But now I wanna show you guys some of their rugs. They definitely have a lot of the trends right, and I'm just blown away. I'd love to know if you guys shop at Dollar General. If you do, comment down below. Maybe we'll come here a little more often. I did bring home a few things I'll be sharing in a collective haul, but I wanna give you guys an idea of some of the prints that they have. Most of these are three by five that are folded. They do have some larger ones that are on rolls that are five by sevens. Can't beat the price. They're all $20 or below. I also found these that remind me a lot of the peel and stick decals that you can find in Target Dollar Spot. They just have so much to choose from. I am really loving this store. Now let's go over to the baskets and this one up here caught my eye, couldn't reach it. They do come in graduated sizes, like I was saying. So usually what I'm finding is that the smallest basket will run $6 and then the medium size will run eight and the larger ones will run 10. At least that's the majority of their baskets, which you cannot beat those prices. You guys know I just took you shopping to Hobby Lobby and we saw how much their baskets were. So I'm just really excited that there are some affordable options. They also have some larger baskets. I'm gonna show you guys here in a minute. Just wanna give you an idea of the sort of medium sized baskets that they have. They also have some in metal. These are really cool. I wish they came in black. Maybe they do. If they do, let me know. Um, but I did find them in white and the largest was 10. $8 for the medium and then six, like I said, for the smaller one. I like the large one. I would keep that by the door for anything like flip-flops during the summer, but this one, so tempted by. I didn't bring it home and I'm still thinking about it. Now this is just the medium and the small. So someone obviously bought the larger one for $10. So as you can see, they do run six, eight, and 10. Now I'm not aware of any coupons or deals that you can get at Dollar General. I'm new to the store. so you have any tips for me let me know in the comments below i also found these that would be great for organization they are large and sort of unstructured so you'd have to work with that but great prices on those they also have this one for 12 and a ton of these galvanized ones i really like these in the metal with the rope detail and they're only five dollars down below, they have some larger ones, great for storage. And I'm surprised that even at this price point, a lot of their baskets do come with liners like this option. Now we're gonna look at some of their decor items and these are awesome. Look at these, these are wooden trays. They're so on trend right now. They're six, eight or $10. They come in two different wood tones. We're gonna get into the kitchen stuff in a minute. And as you can tell, they've got a lot of stuff that you would find in Target Dollar Spot if you could find it. 
So I am really happy with a lot of their ceramic pieces. I've been thrifting a lot and you can't find a vase like that size for $12, even in my thrift stores. And so many of these have a modern look to them, which I'm a big fan of. I found the majority of their medium and smaller things to be only $5. They're so budget friendly and the larger versions of the same items I'm finding run eight. So it seems like, at least from my experience, which is very limited, their ceramics do come in graduated sizes with graduated prices. So they also have a lot of pots for spring. This one's only $4, something like this. Target or Walmart would probably be closer to 10. They also have this one that is a dupe, the ones I shared with you guys in our spring Walmart shop with me. So if you are into ceramics or home decor, you may wanna check out Dollar General. They also have this really cool raised pedestal and some very tall ceramic vases over here. And I love that they're putting out a lot of neutrals, but they also have pops of color. So if you love color, you're going to want to check it out. And you guys, they have some great plants right now. They are $10. This one is a total dupe for that one at Target that is $15 by Studio McGee. And lamps. Who knew? These standing lamps are $30. You can't find anything for $30 in the lamp department. But they have a few other tabletop and hanging options you may want to check out like these. I'm finding a lot of their stuff comes in multiple color options, which is nice. And these are only $10. Now, these remind me a lot of something that you would find at places like West Elm, much higher in stores. And now we're going to get into shelving. I cannot believe how many shelving items they have. So different prices. 12 was pretty much the high end all the way down to five. And I think there's even one option for $4. Now, honestly, none of these are as large as the ones that I just shared with you guys in our Hobby Lobby spring shop with me. But if you have a smaller space and you're looking for just a little place to decorate, definitely want to look here because you're just not going to beat these prices. I believe the largest one that they have is this one with the hooks for 15. They also have these that are perfect for just a few little things for $5. And look at this. It's a two pack for $5. They also have this for eight. It is a two tiered shelf. So lots of wood options and color options in all of these items. And I really do love that there are color options in all of their styles. So if you don't love the white, you can get the wood. They also have similar bins to the ones in Dollar Spot, but these are a little bigger for eight. They have this two pack for $12 in the two color options. And down here they have some really cute fabric bins in gingham. And I could not believe for the size, it was only $7. They also have this one really on trend in the house for eight. Now we're gonna move into more of their wall decor. They have these letter boards with hooks for 10 some hanging jars and another shelf. Just can't get away from them, but as you can tell, they've got a bunch of different styles. Now this is very interesting. It's between like wall decor and a shelf. I love the bronze on it. And then they have a round letter board, which I really like. Here's another one of their housing items. So it's kind of a little planter with a faux boxwood in it. And this for $12, are you kidding me? It is so cute. It can hold eight mugs. And I love that it is the wood and metal combo. Now this artwork is so cute for $15 a two piece. And I just think it's perfect for spring. This would be nice in a bathroom or bedroom anywhere. Seems like they put together these groupings for $15 where you get a larger piece and then three smaller ones. So if you wanna to put together a collage style wall, they've got a lot to choose from. So I'm really happy with their floral prints as well. Those are quite tall and I'd say probably 20 inches for $8. Now down here, I was even more surprised. They have these huge signs. So come in four different versions, the home, the welcome with the vertical gray stripe, and then the horizontal welcome and gather. And I remember thinking they were only $5. They could have been eight or six, but so affordable, definitely under 10. They also have some larger pieces in canvas that would be great hampers, more wall decor, and some big pieces. So I actually did bring home some big pieces of wall decor that are dupes for something at Hobby Lobby. I can't wait to share those with you guys. I am in love with them. And rattan at Dollar General. So this is just a collage frame for 15. You could change up the wood colors if you wanted with some paint. Beautiful frames and some nice size lanterns. Most of these larger items on top are running $10. They also have a wine bottle organizer, 
down here some decorative art for eight. And I like to play a little game when I am looking at decor and guess the price before I turn it over. I completely thought that would be $8. It was five. And another thing I am blown away by are these trays that are $5. Well, this one with the silver was actually eight, but the first two were five. So I am just really surprised now that I've gotten to a Dollar General and had some time to do some shopping. Am I the only person in the world that didn't know about all these amazing decor steals at Dollar General that definitely look higher end and definitely cost a whole lot less? Now, I love these little groupings for pictures. They're only $10 a piece. They come in a few different color options. They also have the medium board at seven and some of their larger decor pieces that they put up on top I couldn't quite reach. But I'm telling you, it is worth a trip in. They also have large wall decor like clocks and some smaller ones that would be better for a tabletop or shelf. And speaking of shelf, they're everywhere. Here's one of the larger ones for 12. They also have a lot of hanging votive or candle holders. I found them in metal, a few different ones in wood and metal combos, and they're all like $8. How can you even go wrong? Now I'm gonna walk you guys through some of their spring items that are hitting the shelves and it's still decor items like these hanging birdhouses and the campers. They also have topiaries, very modern boho. Those are $8. They also have some hanging welcome signs in the camper. These little $1 farmhouse mini signs down here for $5. They have a few other options. That one comes in a cow, a pig, and a hen. They also have some garden flags with the pole for just a dollar and lots of potted succulents. So these are larger than anything we would find at the Dollar Tree for sure. They're four dollars. They are also doing a whole coastal thing for summer. So lots of fun pieces. And again, I am just blown away by the prices. I love these frames. And I know for many coastal people, you like to pick up things during the summer. So if you have a Dollar General, you may want to check it out. They've also got these mini signs for just a dollar. And these fish that are pretty large and metal, white, galvanized, and blue for $4. Some rope hanging mirrors for 5 And this large rope, I'm calling it a buoy. Looks like a buoy. And they also have dupes for the dollar spot wreaths, same price, $5, so there you go. I'm also finding a few spring items like these signs for $4. I'm finding different colors and prints. These are mostly pastel items. And I cannot even believe this perpetual calendar is $4. I played the game and I got it wrong. They also have some hanging pieces of artwork that are really pretty. Those are $5, some more $5 trays. And there are some large garden items I wanna point out like these planters, very high-end looking. Now I will say they're $16. They are plastic, but they don't look cheap. They also have these in a more medium size for 12 and hello there. So I'm not a big fan of the hanging baskets at dollar spot, but this is an actual doable size for 10. These little plants are $3 through 50 maybe, but you wouldn't get that at the dollar spot. You just get the planter. So. I'm completely convinced that I need to be making more trips into Dollar General. I'm loving their summer items like these hanging lanterns that are solar. They're $9. Those in Target would cost probably $15. They also have smaller versions for $5. And the steak lights that come in a few different versions running from $1 up to $4. And they also have the deluxe light up plastic lanterns that are solar for 12. And I also spotted these little garden fence things in brown. They're just like the ones at Dollar Tree. They have some fountains. Now I'm gonna show you guys a few kitchen items. These cutting boards are so cute. I also have marble coasters and I've looked around for these. They're heavy and definitely cost more in other places than $6. Same with these pitchers. I couldn't believe they were only eight have lots of fun gifty items over here as well and a little crock for five dollars down here they have some wood topped canisters for six dollars in metal and this which is so cute for cold drinks during the summer they also have a large owl glass canister for five dollars here's a better look at those gorgeous pictures that are ceramic can you believe that is eight dollars I was very tempted by these. I can't even express to you how much I almost brought one home. Could not get over the price. They also have some fun little dishes, these bowls with the spouts on either side for four. And they do have some large bakeware. Now this I've seen, I think at TJ Maxx, and here it's only $5. Looks like they're gonna be coming out with some things that will give 
re a run for her money over at Walmart and lots of sugars and creamers over here. They also have some, I'm calling them very retro looking baked dishes. They come in a few different sizes and colors. They also have lots of cute little things like miniature pitchers for creamer for $3 some really beautiful mugs. Those are $3 a piece, so not a huge great buy, but they are also putting out some things like butter dishes for spring in the bright colors. They have some large metal serving trays for $5 and this larger one for eight, and some cake pedestals, which I just cannot believe you can find at a Dollar General for $8. I also kind of really wanted to bring this home. It was only $10, but I resisted the urge because I had enough in my basket. They also have quite a few florals. I didn't spend a whole lot of time looking at them, but they do have them if, if you're interested. And some of the highest end looking candles, I didn't sniff them, but they look beautiful. And I am a big fan now, Dollar General. I'm gonna hit it a whole lot more. So let me know what your favorite thing was. And if you have a Dollar General that you shop at regularly, and of course, if I should bring you guys the next time I head in, because I'm definitely headed back in. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you back in the next one.